Today is Monday, April 27th. I didn't get my grass cut this weekend because it started raining Saturday night. It didn't really stop until Monday morning. And if I don't get my grass cut every weekend, I start getting these little purple flowers. I found a place where they were growing in my yard in an area where I don't normally cut the grass and they got bigger so I dug them up and put them in these flower boxes. These are wild violets. It turns out the leaves and the flowers are edible. They have smooth heart-shaped leaves. And they have flowers with five petals. They're not evenly spaced. The same flower structure as a pansy. All of the leaves grow from a central root. Sort of like how a dandelion grows. We got a couple of handy storage boxes to put gardening supplies in and we keep them at the end of the garden rows. Because our ground slopes, I had to level out the place where the containers sit. And I found more violets but these have white flowers. So I dug up a few of the ones with white flowers and put them in pots. And I added them to my collection of wild plants, or what my wife calls weeds. The purple dead nettle on the left and violets on the right with white flowers. And if you look in this flower box full of violets with purple flowers hiding down here along the edge, I think there's some poison ivy growing. But we'll save that for another episode of Plant ID. If you're interested in learning more about the plants growing wild on your property, take a look at Eat the Weeds. It's a really good YouTube channel. It has a lot of information about the plants you'll find growing in your yard. That's it for today.